This is our new toy. So we decided to get a camper since we've been camping a lot. The kids are getting bigger and we have pretty much four tents, five tents actually, four or five hammock sleeping tents. So we decided to get a camper for more, I guess, room, store stuff, have a nice little kitchen to eat. And it actually sleeps. Let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Maybe eight people. If you squeeze them all. Oh, wait. No, eight, nine, ten people, actually. But we'll take a look at this. Show you inside. Very nice owners. They lived in it for a while. And then they got a little place. And they thought they're not going to keep the camper. So we got it. And it's awesome because it's a bunkhouse and it has plenty of room for all the kids and guests. Going inside now for our new, well, new to us. So we got the back. This is mine and my husband's. Got plenty of little space. The bed actually, like, it's like a queen size bed and you actually could pick it up get all the storage up underneath there which the storage has the access uh, panels on the right and left side on the outside so you can just access stuff from that side too and let's see we've got some cabinet space some deep old cabinets in there they left us some angle sit-up cushions we put the blankets and sheets they added an extra like they screw this stuff or like kind of sort of screwed it to the floor but the little thing just extra area to put stuff whole thing screwed to the wall and stuff and these little footstools but we can store stuff in them and keep them over here because then they won't move around while we're driving you use them as footstools but they're actually pretty good for uh storage oh this is hard to do with one hand <laughs> there it goes there you go and that keeps it like out of the way now we move into the kitchen sort of area and this couch actually moves down so you can put well one adult two kids on the bed um two adults on the bed and you got the kitchen area Little stove, already put some stuff in there. Pans and stuff. Microwave. Clean microwave, some storage. They have like, they left us dishes, but I don't know if I'm really too fond of those glass dishes moving around. Uh, they got, got plugs everywhere, got the sinks. Um, this table actually folds down. Um, you pop the the post out and set it down and you put all the cushions down so this is like one adult bed or um two kids and in the back so this is the bunkhouse version and they make a couple different versions of bunkhouses sometimes the bunks are on that side but then it's only like a single bunk single and single or they make a double and a single well this was two doubles so you can actually fit two full adults on each one of these beds um or the two kids so we got four kids and we got plenty of space for us the kids and maybe a couple guests to when we go camping they left us the pots and pans um everything seems to be clean nothing seems to be leaking we got they put a little spice rack up i put these bungees on it so we could stick spices in it and they left us some other little things in the inside Got a little radio system. The TV actually can come off the wall and there's another mount so you can bring it outside. Then you got the sink out here. So that's great because then they can wash and do whatever they need to do out here. And then the toilet and the tub, tub shower, um, is in here. So that's pretty cool. It's actually a stand up. You can actually stand up and take a shower. And then you got the fridge and freezer built in right here. 
So it's got the, so you can vent it. You got the little lock. So you just slide the little lock over, open it, and then you get a nice clean fridge and freezer. So you can lock it, close it, and then open and close it as, as you have it plugged into plugged into space but for venting so it doesn't get moldy and so you can air it out just kind of like like latch it like not all the way close it just kind of like latch the thing right there so and they are just kind of so when you're traveling it doesn't um come open but it stays open to vent it so you don't get that mold in there and this is our camper it's the 26 bunk house so but by the title paperwork it's 32 feet so i thought it was like a 26 28 foot one but i think i got it to measure it and they might include the tongue and everything in it for the title but that's what we got